I am getting ready for spring, the sun is shining, so I'm in the mood and I thought why not change the, the, the coffee table decorations. So I looked up some stuff online on Pinterest and I saw some amazing ideas. I went out and I bought everything, so I thought why not share it with you. Um, I would love to show you how you can easily decorate the table depending on the season and now it's almost spring, so we're gonna play around with roses and some light colors. So if you wanna know how I'm gonna decorate the table, um, ready for spring please keep on watching this is our coffee table it's a pretty heavy one but I found it online two years ago and I fell in love with the design um, it's painted by this artist and there is like a, a glass on top of it so there is so much going on already um, and that's exactly what I wanted I wanted to have a table that has so much decorations without having to put too many things on it and um, it's it's the perfect one so the first thing that I found very important to have on my coffee table is of course books. I found the perfect books that actually have not only the perfect color, but also the things that we love, Federico and I. This is a Rolex book because Federico loves vintage Rolex watches. And on top of it is something that's for me because this book is all about New York and all the amazing places in New York. And here we have one fashion book and underneath it, um, lifestyle books so it's all about decoration and all about uh, how to style your home so these books um, say a lot about who is living here and what our interests are now depending on the size of the table this might be full enough for yours but because i have a very large coffee table i still need something for this space so i found the perfect coffee table tray which will fill this empty space around here now a tray is a perfect space to actually collect some items and put them together. It keeps everything together without making it look too messy on the table. And eventually they will not move around, so they will stay on the tray. And this gives a very clean, um, also very organized look. No coffee table is complete without flowers and I decided to go for these beautiful white and peachy roses. Um, it's a medium sized vase, so this one goes all the way in the back. And of course also a big candle, this one goes right next to it and smells so good. The third item or decoration that goes on the table is a statue. Now you can go for anything you want. I wanted to go for white. Um, same thing goes for the roses and the candle and the statue just to calm the colors down because there's so much going on with the colors of the book and the tray and the table's already very obvious. So I'm keeping it a little bit calm and fresh by, uh, by um, cho choosing for the white color. Right next to the statue, I'm gonna put another candle put a little bit more to the front and then we have an empty space around here I bought this cute box that goes right next to it so as you can see the biggest items go all the way to the back and then the smallest one in the front and everything is complementing each other without covering each other so you can still see everything if you look from this side now because there is so much going on on the tray I'm still missing something here so I have a white vase with white roses on top of the books and right next to it uh, this very cute gold uh, box where you can put stuff in it we're almost done here i bought this very cute plant that i decided to put on top of the book just because this green will complement the book as well so both green and then right next to that or a little bit behind it this cute vase with nothing in it because i don't want to go too high so it's um you can put it this side or maybe this side and it complements the other gold um uh, box right next to it So this is it for today's video. I hope you guys liked it. Uh, let me know in the comments below what would you like to see next. I know I've been a little bit um, offline here on YouTube, but we're trying to uh, put more videos here and include more things like lifestyle and um, makeup videos and stuff like that. So um, yeah, let me know down below. And uh, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. I hope to see you next time. Bye.